Hey, what's up guys? I'm Mr. Timeless and I got some pretty exciting news for you guys today. So, Cool Chip Technologies is redesigning the computer fan. So, before I get into all the information about this, I do want to mention that I found this article on December 9th and it's, it's about, like two weeks old, but uh, I did not see many people posting anything about it. And since I just started my gaming news slash tech news videos, I want to let you guys know about this technology because I find it amazing. It benefits gaming on PC, it benefits uh, gaming on console, specifically the Xbox One, and it really just benefits uh, PCs in general so uh, let's get started so cool chip is a company it's a startup company and they pretty much uh, designed a new computer fan that's half the size of a traditional PC fan but it performs much better 35 to 40 percent better thermal performance than a traditional PC fan which is great because that means it uh, dissipates the heat it gets rid of the heat from your computer 35 to 40 percent better which is always fantastic because you know uh, heat and dust are like the enemies of computers and if you can get rid of one then that's amazing especially heat because that's always there no matter what you can't clean heat you know you can clean your computer I by the way I don't recommend clean it with like uh, anything wet like compressed air would be the best way to clean it from any dust but um, anyways that's not about the, that's not about this video so um, the fan that they're making is like I said half the size uh, 35 to 40 percent better at dissipating the heat and it's also much quieter so a lot of PC gamers uh, uh, that or any PC person that uses their computer to their to their uh, max performance and requires a lot of uh, performance from the CPU or GPU um, knows that uh, the fans inside your computer start running much faster at a, a faster RPM because. Um, your computer, you know, is processing more things, which makes it like heat up more. So, you know, your fans need to work extra hard, which causes more noise because it's spinning faster. And a lot of PC gamers don't want to hear, you know, your the, the fan spinning, which is understandable. And um, so this company's fan, not only does it do everything I said it does, but it's almost silent because um, the co-founder, uh, William Sanchez, uh, he claims that his fan is so quiet that he could put his uh, he could put a mic to it and you wouldn't be able to really hear anything. But um, you would hear it from a traditional uh, PC fan. And that's what he did. So um, in this interview, he actually grabbed the mic, put it next to his startup fan. Uh, when I say startup fan, I mean his fan. So he put it up to his fan and you really couldn't hear it spinning at all. And then when he put it up to a traditional PC fan, you could hear it spinning, and they were both spinning at the same RPM, uh, but what, and they were both dissipating the same amount of heat, but one was much quieter, and also his fan uses up less power, so not only does it, is it half the size, dissipates the heat 35 to 40% better, it's much quieter, but it uses, it uses less electricity, which is awesome because it creates less heat for itself, which is you know, like I said, awesome. And uh, another thing is a partner with Cooler Master uh, to bring this technology to the aftermarket, like as an aftermarket add-on, uh, early next year. So we might even see this technology at CES, which is an electronic expo that all the big companies like Sony, Microsoft, you know, Apple. I'm not sure about Apple, but I'm pretty sure maybe I don't know. But anyways, a lot of uh, uh, you know, tech companies show off their new technologies, you know, TVs, computer monitors, computers, all that stuff. And we, we're most likely going to see this because they partnered with Cooler Master and they're bringing this technology next year which is really great because usually when you hear about new technology they say oh you know we'll have it in uh, down the line in like three four years but this is coming next year early next year too that, that's what it says so that is pretty amazing but one thing that I really want to get to that really uh, you know wanted me to make this video is Microsoft consulted with the startup uh, and asking them if they could use their fans for a for an Xbox one game console which is really cool because that that kind of like I guess hence that Microsoft and it's no surprise really because Microsoft's Xbox one let's let's be honest here it's a little big it's on the heavy side so kind of big when I say heavy side I don't mean like uh, you know it's heavy to carry but I mean like big as in big so yeah I mean it's bulky and I'm pretty sure Microsoft knows that compared to the PS4 which is a little bit tinier and it's it doesn't even have a brick. It doesn't have a power brick. Like, all the stuff is inside the PS4, and then it's just uh, cables, and that's it. It's not like it has a power brick, which... And then the Xbox One's not only bigger, but it has a power brick, which makes no sense. Which I understand, because Microsoft last year... I mean, not last year. I went on their 360, had the problem with the Red Rings of Death, and it was because it was overheating. So I guess they wanted to avoid that. So they made the Xbox One, you know, uh, much bigger, so it could dissipate the heat better. And it's just... I can see why they did it, but it's... I mean, if the PS4 was able to do it without overheating, I'm pretty sure the Xbox One can. And that's kind of why I guess they're consulting the... Uh, 
the startup if they can use their fans for the next uh, unannounced Xbox. That's what it says, as well as in... Because it, th this is exactly what it said. Microsoft consulted with the startup to make quieter fans for the I Xbox One games console, as well as an upcoming unannounced Xbox. And it's obviously going to probably be an Xbox Slim and this fan's gonna not only make the fan, uh, I mean, the Xbox run quieter because you know you won't be able to really hear it, but also you know it'll dissipate less heat, which will make them be able to make the console even smaller, which is awesome. So it is the Xbox Slim. Um, there's almost no doubt about that. But the issue, yeah, well, it's not really an issue, but I think they're not gonna release an Xbox One Slim in 2015 at E3. They're not gonna announce it. I think it's still too early. Um, I'll be surprised if they do. I could be wrong, um, but in June at E3, I really don't see them announcing an Xbox One Slim this early on. I, I can see it definitely happening on in a uh, 2016 though. Um, maybe they'll do it this year though. Who knows? Because you know PS4 has been dominating them for quite a long time, and it's not only till the, all the price cuts that uh, Xbox One was finally able to beat them in November, and we'll see how they do in December. But um, uh, I don't know. I think this is pretty exciting news. Not, like I said, for the Xbox One, maybe the PS4 is going to also adopt this. And if they do, I can't imagine how smaller the PS4 is going to get. Um, it'll be cool to see how slim that one that one will get. But anyways, um, what do you guys think about this uh, news? Do you think this is a good thing, bad thing? I don't see why you think it's a bad thing though. But uh, yeah, I, I'm excited for this, and I can't wait to see this technology. Um, I hopefully will have pictures in, in, hopefully I had pictures throughout the video, which I probably will, uh, uh, showing you the fan, and I will also have a link in the description down below, so you guys can go check out the article yourselves, because this technology is fantastic, and I think more people should know about it, not only um, for the consoles, but also if you're a PC gamer and you hate your fan, maybe this is the, uh, like, aftermar aftermarket add-on that you want to buy for your PC. Um, so that's pretty much it. Uh, that's all I have for you guys. Thanks for watching. If you liked, found this informative at all, please leave it a like, subscribe if you haven't done so already, and I will see you guys next time. Peace out.